Hello, he's Rupert Soskin. <laughs> and he's Michael Bott. <laughs> Welcome to another Prehistory Flash, where we look into some of the exciting discoveries and research being carried out in the world of prehistoric archaeology. And today we're looking at a discovery from the district of Turbingen in southwest Germany where archaeologists have unearthed a tiny spiral of gold, probably a hair ornament, and this is the oldest gold ever found in the region. A team led by Professor Reiko Krauss from the Institute of Prehistory and Medieval Archaeology at the University of Tübingen and Dr. Jörg Bofinger from the Baden-Württemberg State Office for Cultural Heritage Management based in Esslingen have excavated the 3,800-year-old burial of a young woman who was around 20 when she died. Intriguingly, the gold spiral, just over one centimetre across, was the only artefact to be placed in the tomb. And as precious metals are rare in burials in Germany, it seems likely that this represents a high-status individual. The grave is close to a number of other Bronze Age burials connected with a nearby hilltop settlement, but what makes this find so remarkable is not that it is the oldest gold found in the region, but that analysis of the alloy's composition shows that it came from southwestern Britain, specifically the area around the Carnan River in Cornwall. Another reason this is so significant is that almost all other gold artefacts found on the continent are made from gold coming from deposits in southeastern Europe. The actual breakdown of elements for the gold alloy are that it contained around 20% silver, about 2% copper, along with traces of platinum and tin. Now this kind of composition is typical for river-sourced gold, and this specific makeup is what places its origin with fair certainty in Cornwall. The woman was buried facing to the south and in a fetal position. Carbon-14 dating of her remains have given a date range between 1850 and 1700 BC, so this shows clearly that trading of precious metals was taking place more widely than thought for the period. I wonder if they're planning on doing any strontium analysis of her teeth. Oh, I wonder. Yes. It, well, it would be interesting to know, wouldn't it? If she, you know, was she local to where she was buried, or maybe she even brought the gold with her? Hmm. Interesting conjectures. Who knows? And on that <laughs> note, there you go, folks. Three thousand eight hundred year old Cornish gold found in southern Germany. Hope you enjoyed that. We'll see you again very soon. See you, folks. Bye.